And most of our swing, we actually do an open hold. So what we're going to be able to do is get from a close to an open, come back together. Um, so we're going to do that as a turn. Yeah. And then we get to spin around as well. Yeah, so we're doing the top turn and length. So we'll just do a quick demo so we get. We'll do one more, just a bit of an angle. Back drop step replace, which if you look at the previous video, there's a bit more detail on that. But that's all you're doing with the steps. What you've got to think about more is how to guide your lady. Remember, you're not throwing her about, you're guiding. Yeah? So, what am I doing with that? After the back drop, oh, yeah? so that's one, two, three. Hand goes up on the three. One, two, three. My right hand is up on the shoulder blade, I just give a little bit of a lead from there. That's all. I'm not more. I'm never making her turn. I'm suggesting to my partner that I'd like her to turn. Yeah. Uh, and this, the, the assumption is, of course, ladies, that you're, you're cooperative with that. Don't <laughs> do no, no, no. Uh, he's, if you don't want him to shove you around, then you assume that's going to work out fine. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so with that, the most important thing is the timing of it. Make sure you do it on that first side step so that you can turn the right point. Um, for the ladies, so with that we are doing a turn and mostly it's really just a spin on your right foot. Um, so you'll get the lead as you take your side step. From there you're going to take your weight into the ball of the foot, spin around and when you're done turning, put your foot down. Now, if you only get part way around, that's fine, you just complete the turn once you put your foot down. If you're quite happy spinning around, then it just goes, you just put your foot down underneath yourself once you've completed your turn. Now, the easiest way to make sure that you finish where you need to finish is to look at your partner. Now, Mary's got an easy job here because her partner is incredibly good looking. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> even if he's not good looking as me, he's still, still doing the same thing. So find your partner, look at your partner. Yeah. From that point, we're just doing a basic step. So we go into our back drop, and it's really just a basic step. We can come back into hold, or we can leave the hold open, depending on what you want to do next. Um, now again, with that little link on the end, gentlemen, and I should often see these do just as bad. After the back drop, there's no, there's no heave. Yeah. If I just put a mere little bit of pressure, there, just bring my hand in. That's it. I don't have to pull and throw my partner around. Remember, gentlemen, you're leading, but you're not going to be bossy. Yeah. yeah. So, when we are dancing um, in what we call open facing position, or with just a handhold, a good guide for the distance between you is that your elbow should be roughly in at the side. So, if your arm's extended, mm -hmm. then you've done your turn and you've, you're too Bossy. far away. Likewise, so, if the elbow's behind you, then. You're too close. <laughs> But basically, if the elbow's in roughly at the side, then you'll find that coming into hold even, there's not a lot of change in, in terms of your position. Yeah. So put that through one more time. One, two, three. Boom, 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 boom. And back to this one. How easy is that? Give it a go, champions. See you again. See you next time. Bye-bye.